My name is Mutha, and I was born in Kurdistan, a Burma. My family and I came to Australia on the 5th of August in 2009. Because um, why didn't I come to Australia in Jilob? That one, uh, because um, when I'm I'm flying in you know, when I'm flying in Australia, and then my kids will go to pick up me. I don't know where to go, where to go, go to, or uh, where is the place? I don't know anywhere. But uh, they are drop me in Geelong, and then I'm around in Geelong. That's I know. Oh, here yeah, it's Geelong. That's why. <laughs> I don't know anyone in Geelong, but I know my friend in Werribee, but because the you know my kids will tell me later when I ask um, because. I cannot go to Werribee because in the Werribee they say food, uh, you know, it's not many places for the people, so they drop me in here, that's I'm come here, that's why, yeah. Um, I'm told that before, I was born in Kristen in Burma, when when I was six years old, I my parents moved into refugee camp, and they are uh, staying in refugee, refugee camp about 15 years, yes. And then when I stayed in Burma, when during I was six, six years old, I have a, I have a time to go to school. I have, I have a to go to school. And then when I came to, when I moved into refugee camp, then I start to go to school and learning at the primary school and then go step by step to year 10 like that. Yeah, and then, Oh uh, yeah, in Jilam. When I I came to Jilam, uh, Australia, first I go to school, and then about three months or four months, then I'm trying to do work, trying to get experience, work experience in, in Australia. So um, first I'm looking for a job. I get the first job is you know the rabbit factory, which is doing the rubbish. A rabbit, like uh, with skinning, skinning and curtain and carbon, and put in the box and send to the supermarket like that. Wow, we do that, and then that's I got the first skin, and then after that I'm not really happy. I I went to get more skin in Australia, so um um just forget that job and then put. Put put up and then I go back to school. Then I do the you know the whole culture course. Yeah, I did that, and then I finished that term. Then I yeah I got whole culture course. Really yes, but I'm not happy. And I try to looking for the luck mechanic because I love I love to work a mechanic job like that one. And so I um, ask my job now one and the and divested. Yeah. And then they're trying to look for that, and then uh, I get a, you know, I go, I get a mechanic course. It's called Henry Town, but now Henry Town is the, you know, for the device type that one. Yep. And I finish this course, yeah, and after that I did a apprenticeship two weeks, and then yeah, about this I did a apprenticeship two weeks. Then we go to school and then we get a certificate. After that, my boss called me back and to continue the apprenticeship. And then I did this about one month. Then my boss said, you are working good, but your English is not really good. And then he said, better than you go back to school. And then one year, then you can come back. And then all the way, I will open the door for you. He said that. <laughs> That's, I was very happy. And then I said, yeah, that's good. That's good to help me to improve my English. They want to campaign and continue English. And yes, they want. Looking back, and I think it back in my country, uh, after, you know, the World War II, when the English left that country, give that the Korean and the Burmese rule that country together. After that, the Burmese, Burmese government and Burmese soldier, powerful, on our Korean. Yeah, so the Korean people cannot learn, cannot go to school, just only have to learn only Burmese language. 
cannot learn Korean language. But after that, Korean leader, they see that it's not good because we don't have opportunity to learn our language. So the Korean government support with the Burmese government, and then they do that. The surprise, yeah, and that they have school. But in Australia, we should, uh, for me, I would like to tell, we should love our current language and keep our cultures. I don't want to lose that one because that is, if we compare that is a good and a great and that we should keep that one, you know, all the way that one. I don't want to lose that one for me, yes. So, and I hope Chindra come in later there. They were trying to learn of their culture, and their language, and that they will know who they are from and who they are, you know, one day when the people ask. And that if they do have to, if they do not go to learn that, they don't know. So when the people ask, ask them, who are you and where are you from? So they don't know. What's your culture? They don't know as well. So one day I went to, you know, the children coming up, they were shown their culture. They were shown they speak their language. Yeah, that one in the world.